There are a lot of different ways to make your own gasket. Uh, there are methods where you simply put the item on gasket paper and trace it. You know, there are methods where you put a sheet of paper over the part and rub a crayon on it to get an outline of the part. Those methods do work, but they don't always work so great on something like this, which is a complex shape. This is the back plate of this impact wrench, and you can see with all the different air passages and everything, this takes a complex gasket. I'm going to show you an easy way to make a gasket for a complex part like this. Using this method, you will need a few different things. Obviously, the part that you are going to make a gasket for, some gasket material. This is Felpro Caro Pack. It's 1 32nd of an inch. I found that it works well for air tools, and I just picked this up at my local parts store. And obviously, you'll need some things to cut out the new gasket. Of course, you're going to need a scanner, and we will go get that right now. Here we have the scanner and the part we want to copy. So put the part face down in the scanner and scan it. One thing to remember is that the printed copy cannot be bigger or smaller than the original. It has to be life size. So check the settings on your scanner. Here's what you should end up with. I actually made mine into a digital PDF file so I can print out a new one of these sheets anytime I want. Next, cut out around the image to create a template for the new gasket. After you cut out the template, you'll have something like this. The reason mine is all orange is because I laid it out on the gasket paper, then I sprayed it all down with spray paint to get the outline for the new gasket. But you don't need to do that. You can also just trace around the edges with a pen or marker. Then simply cut out your new gasket. Here's the template I used, here's the gasket I made, and here's the original part. You can see it's a pretty close match. The reason this is all dirty is because I've actually been using it for a little while in the impact and it's working great. If you have any questions about what I did, go ahead and post them below and I'll try to answer them. If you liked this video, hit the like button and make sure to subscribe so you can see my new videos when they come out.